Our guest is the president of the Los Angeles City Council. His leadership has helped the city navigate through some difficult situations. It is my pleasure to welcome Council President Paul Krikorian. How are you? I am great. How are you doing, Anna? Doing it's good well. to be with you. Yeah, glad to have you on. You chair an ad hoc committee on government reform. Independent redistricting, why is that so important for you? You know, in order for people to have confidence in the democratic process, uh, they need to feel that the system is not being gamed. And frankly, under the old model, it, it was, because the process we had was not independent. What does redistricting do for folks who are looking to be reelected? Does it complicate matters once the redistricting is done? Well, um, I, in my view, it should be irrelevant um, because we should redistrict according to the interests of communities, not the interests of elected officials. And so if this hurts somebody in their re-election campaign, that should be irrelevant to the process. We want to create fair districts that equitably include all of the communities of Los Angeles uh, and allow their voice to be heard. And the election results, you know, that will, those cards will fall, you know, however they fall. That's what independent redistricting really should be. I mean, I'm hoping that you guys can all figure this redistricting out because I just need to elect you. I get what we have to do, right? This massage to create districts that benefit you all. When we listened to those tape recordings of that meeting, people were, of course, shocked by some of the racist things that were said during that conversation. But let's remember that the topic of the conversation was how to draw district lines in a way that would favor the members who were participating in that conversation, even to the point of disenfranchising entire communities within the city of Los Angeles. I am completely confident that we've produced a terrific policy recommendation for the council on independent redistricting, and I'm very proud that we're doing this for the first time in 100 years. Is the 2024 election a reality? Is yes. That, that's what you're shooting for? Yes. For sure, redistricting will be on the November 2024 ballot. I guarantee that. Now, you, Mayor Bass, and a delegation of council members spent some time in our nation's capital. The LA Department of Water and Power will receive $48 million dollars in a federal grant to expand and strengthen the clean energy that we're all going for here. The DWP is on track to achieve 100% clean energy by the year 2035. And what we're doing through LA100 is really the model for the rest of the nation. Thank you, Council President Kerkorian. We were so glad to have you on today.